Hey, what's up? I wanted to put together a video for you because I know that when you're trying to decide if you wanna invest in a new product or not, sometimes a video is just easier to decide over pictures, especially when you're shopping online. But I also wanted to just put some education out there about my Finer Lips product. So if you don't know me, I'm Kaylee Phillips. I'm the owner and CEO of Tin Wagon, the brand, Tin Wagon, the fine accessory and fine apparel store. And I recently branched out and created a lip line called Finer Lips. And that is what I'm gonna be talking about today in this video. I was just on the hunt for a matte lipstick, preferably liquid. I love a liquid matte that I was returning to the store to grab more of when it ran out, you know? Like I wanted to want to replenish that same product, but I was, I was like always jumping around from brand to brand because nothing was, nothing was it for me. So here we go. I created my own and this is it. <laughs> I hope that um, when you try this lipstick that you agree. I know I've gotten great feedback so far, so thank you. But here we go. Um, a little bit about the products that I offer right now. I have four lip line shades. And I'm a firm believer that lip line is a must because it's going to define your natural lip and it's going to make it look, your lips look so much more plump, so much more full, just immediately. You can overline if you want. I choose to overline a little bit, not dramatically. <laughs> I don't want my lips to look like super unnatural, right? So that's kind of the point in overlining and I'll show you how I overline, but you don't want to make them look super unnatural. Like you just kind of want to highlight what you already have um, to make them look a little bit more full. So four lip lines, we started with four matte liquid lip shades and this is what my containers look like. I love that they are, you know, a little bit more compact. However, this is actually in compare or like comparable to um, some of the other popular liquid matte lipsticks. They're like 1.1, 1.2 ounces. This is 1.8 ounces. So don't let like the shortness of the container like make you think it's like not a lot of product because it's gonna last you a long time. Um, so yes, for liquid mattes, I have recently added two more liquid mattes and um, this one is a holiday exclusive and then this one is gonna stick around, I believe. It's, we'll see, you know? That's what's fun is you can try shades out and mix it up and, you know, when it's your own, your own brand. Um, and then we had four glosses and I don't know if I have them all in front of me. It looks like I don't, but they're the same container and this is a holiday, this is our holiday gloss. It's called Frosted. So it is a shimmer gloss, but it's not dramatic like shimmer. It's just the right amount. Um, here's another one called Glow Girl. Rodeo Wife is my absolute favorite. It's more of like a, a mauve brown gloss. Um, so let's do this. First, I will just kind of do my lips for you. And while I do that, I'll talk about the product. Um, I'm gonna go in with Coco Liner. This is the one I always use. I use Coco every day. Even if I'm going in with a nude lip, I just love a dark liner. Um, and I'm not really used to this landscape for having my phone like this landscape. Um, but I know I'm gonna upload this to YouTube, so that's why it's like this. But first we're just gonna go in. So I'm gonna, my eyes are gonna go from here and I'm gonna focus on my lips. Um, I always go in at the bottom here and I have prepped my lips. Let's just say that I used our luxury lip scrub first to knock off any of that dead skin. You're gonna wanna do that, so. 
your product applies much smoother, more consistent. So as you can see, I kind of feathered that on. I went kind of back and forth, small strokes. I didn't just do one, like, <coughs> one harsh line. And then, <coughs> excuse me, I'm gonna go in and just smudge that out a bit. And I'll show you, <coughs> one second, how I overline just a little bit. So you're gonna look here and you're gonna see my natural lip line. I'm literally gonna take the point of the pencil and just go right above my natural lip line. And then I'll bring that color down onto my lip a little bit. Smudging. So you can already see a huge difference. See how my lip is just so defined that is why I choose to do a liner every day um and then yeah you know um I love to smudge it out you don't have to smudge it out as much as I did if you like a more harsh like contrast between your lip liner and your lip color so now I'm just gonna go in with my absolute all-time favorite color which is like was our best seller last time around. Um, and it is called Velvet Dusk. It's just a nice everyday, it's like a, a little bit, it's got a little bit of like pop of color to it, but it's like a brown mauve and it's just amazing. So you're going to take your color and a little goes a long way with this formula um, you're going to go in and I'm just going to start here at the bottom. And like, it applies so soft, so smooth, and it's like creamy when you apply it, but it's going to dry matte. Um, and that is like, I would consider that one coat. And I'm gonna go back in after letting it dry just for just a second and do one more. And I kind of, I can go back and fix that later. But um, another thing I like to say is how lightweight the formula is. So you like literally don't feel like you have anything on your lips. And I mean that because I've tried so many liquid um mattes that it like dries out your lips this will not do that i've like not heard anybody like say otherwise either um but there is so you can see it's drying now as like more of a matte look and you can leave it i like to apply a gloss um over the top so i'm going to do that 
But just a few things to know about the formula itself is just that like this is um, super um, like natural ingredients, um, no parabens. It's got vitamin E, um, avocado oil. It promotes like elasticity in your lips and um, suppleness. So it just is going to kind of help your lips naturally just look and feel more um, luscious, I guess. <laughs> okay, and I'm gonna go over the top of that with Rodeo Wife, which is my favorite. So I'm just doing my favorite lip combo for you today. Um, it's that gloss that's a little bit shimmer, but it's more of like a brown mauve. Um, It smells like vanilla. <laughs> okay. So there's that. And um, I firmly believe your makeup look is not complete without a lipstick. Okay. And it's that's why our little slogan is finish your look find your lips finish your look because really like I feel so naked without lipstick and I don't feel right without something on my lips uh, a few things to know about our lip gloss um, it contains CBD oil and hyaluronic acid so just moisturizing not sticky you know, it's not overwhelmingly like, oh, like I've got gloss on my lips. Like it's not something where you're like, okay, that's overwhelming, that feeling, you know. It's, um, it just feels smooth and moisturizing, really, I guess is the best way to say it. Uh, so that is my go-to lip look for you. So just to recap, I used Coco Liner and I used our matte um, lip color in the shade Velvet Dusk, which it was one of our best sellers. And then I used our top seller, um, Rodeo Wife, as the gloss over the top to create this look. So now what I would do is I would just go blot my lips a little bit and that's it. I probably won't have to reapply um, the color. A lot of times I'll just go back and grab some more gloss to um, just make them feel a little bit more moisturized throughout the day. But again, a non-drying formula, a bold formula, um, a little goes a long way. It is pretty smudge proof as well. So, <sighs> It's just a really great product um, and I hope that this video like helped you decide if you wanted to try it out or not. And if you do, please, please, please give us a review, give us some feedback. We are a new brand, so we just love hearing from all of the ladies who supported us um, in the early stages and we, we just wanna know what you think and help out our future gals trying to decide um, by, you know, writing a little review on our website. It would be so helpful. All right, but I'm going to get off of here now and get to work. All right, thanks. Bye, guys.